Hello, humans and pets. Today is a big day. Big day. Little Caesars released a new item as of recently. I'm They're gonna be eating it. I, I think it's today. as of today. I think so. Um, it is the new Old World Fancy Roni Pepperoni. Uh, we got one of them. It's $9.99. Um, I'm excited to try it. So, apparently it has more than 100 pieces of pepperoni for $9.99. Well, let's see. see. Let's see. You gotta open it up. I'm ready. Yeah, that's oh, looking like has, a lot of pepperoni. That's a lot of pepperoni on it. Here huh? you go. Uh, I can't see a bite without pepperoni. And it's right to the edge. They said they, that that was one of their things. They said right to the edge, and they said, like, all on the whole. That's a lot of pepperoni. That's a lot of pepperonis. You wanna just try pepperonis? I wanna try a piece, so go ahead. Oh, whoa. An extra pepperoni. So many pepperonis is one on the thing. One on the thing. No desert in this baby. No. Yeah, tell John. Jim, as Jim. you like to call it. Yeah, no, no desert this, on this no one. No desert on this one. All right, grab, grab a piece, okay, man. What, what piece are you doing? do you want? I don't know. You're, I'm waiting. One thing I around. wish they had is the little table. The pizza table. Oh, to keep it so it doesn't... No, so you, you can separate the pizza. That's not what it's for. It's what it's, it's for. so the doesn't. box doesn't hit and take your cheese off and stuff. No, you can use the table to separate them. So that way you don't touch all the pieces when you try to grab a piece. I don't know about any It's of that. definitely more than a hundred. You're not gonna count them? Um, like like the count? One, two. That would be a lot of counting. No, I don't know how to I'm count. Only kidding. Them, Why did you open it back up again? Well, so they can see it. Okay. All right. Can you get them? I want to try the pizza. I'll hold it like this. We haven't had pizza in a while. We we haven't had a uh, little Caesar. We haven't had any pizza in a while. Yeah. There, there hasn't been anybody that did anything new in quite a long time. Right. So, all right, we gotta try it. Hmm. Now we were just talking about this. Mm -hmm. When I was a kid, this is the pepperoni that we got all the time. It always curled up and always dead. In this new age pepperoni, doesn't do that. No. This pepperoni has so much more flavor because, like you said, it gets a little crisp to it. Gets it gets the crispy. Because it cups up and gets caught into the thing and, and gets the little crisp to it. I need more than one bite for my full assessment. Little Caesars just knows the oh. perfect ratio of sauce to cheese. It's always They perfect. honestly do. They have a nice sauced pizza. Mm hmm. Love the crisp of the pepperoni. This hands down is the best pepperoni pizza I've had in a long time. I think it's the best I've ever had. Really, the pepperoni has a spice to it. It, it changes the texture and the taste when it gets that little little crisp. Pepperoni is always better. We, I do it all the time. Yeah. Even if I'm cooking eggs or something, because we usually have summer sausage and pepperoni. Mm. Those are good on their own. But when you would you please just sit when <laughs> when you. When you toast, when you just put them in a pan for a right. couple seconds, they just really, <laughs> they just taste that much better. Wow. He's comfy. Subscribe for the fin. Now, granted, it's only a pepperoni pizza. I mean, the only thing that would make this better is if they threw cheese in the crust. This would be like a 10.5 out of 10. You don't even really need it, though. I just like it. Mm. It just adds to... But on a good note, I don't know if you can see my piece. They at least pepperoni on the crust. Mm. So, at least you're not just eating crust. That's my only pot of pizza. Normally, Ryan will tell you, I'll rip the, the back right off, and I eat that first. He eats the crust first. I know. I think it's weird, because what are you going to hold while you eat the pizza? He just like, he makes a table for the pizza. But it's the worst taste. You know what I mean? It's the worst part of the pizza. But so I always eat the pizza. When the they have butter it. Honestly, I've said this time and time again. And I almost wish Uncle Michael would show up early so that he could try it when it's still warm. Because he always says he down. hated. Little not, he didn't hate it, but it was his worst pizza. Like He didn't like Little Caesars. And I'm like, really? Have you tried it recently? Because honestly, this is... I love the pepperoni. Hands down, favorite pizza of the year. 
favorite pizza of my life, I'm going to say. I think this is the best pizza I've ever had. Um, this this style of pepperoni just really does give you that. It gives you a better zip. It gives you a better taste. Mm. And the fact that yes, it's all the way to the edge. But I don't know. You leave a comment down below. Mm -hmm. I know growing up, we had like one main in our town. We had one main pizza place. And when you got a pepperoni pizza, or well, actually the other town that I went to school with was even worse. Mm -hmm. And you take a piece of their pizza, it would literally have to go like this. Yeah. To just get like, and you'd be there for like minutes while the grease is just dripping off. For this much pepperoni on it, I thought it'd be way greasy. This is a this is a pretty greasy list. And the pizza. cheese. Well, that's what I'm saying. Between the two of them, usually you you get the cheese pool, and I don't mind that. You know, drip it off a little bit and eat it. You really, it's not greasy. No, it's like they took a napkin on each individual pepperoni and soaked it all up. I don't know. And the crust. It's always super soft. Mm -hmm. Has a nice little butter on it. Just just as an added flavor. It's a really good pepperoni pizza. I think it's the best pizza I've ever had. It beats like the shakaroni we had. It, it beats well, like all of them. Why would you settle for like the extra most bestest already has pepperoni in every bite. Mm -hmm. This just takes it a step forward. Because you got the good pepperoni in every bite. But they didn't really go up on price. It's $9.99. Nine ninety nine is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I think, like, I can't believe it. Honestly, because if if we, if, if, I don't. Well, I think you can get. I think you can get a, a medium size at Domino's. I don't even remember. I haven't gone to Domino's. Domino's is like twenty piece. bucks. I was only gonna have one, but this was so good. I could eat the whole pizza. Challenge. Mm hmm. I'm missing that crazy bread. But a record, we almost did that. Mm. Because Little Caesars is, is, is so inexpensive, <laughs> and we kept watching all these food challenges and food challenges, so I kept saying, uh, one of the food challenges somewhat near us was, mm. how big was it? Was it 11 pound pizza? It was something like that, and Ryan's like, I could eat that. And I'm like, you can eat an 11 pound pizza? I'm like, there's no way. He's like, I could do it. Well, it was a two-man challenge, but I'm yeah. like, you'd have to eat like six and a half, almost six pounds. It was almost a 12-pound pizza, I think. Mm. He's like, I could do it. I could do it. I said, all right, just much like when we did the half-gallon ice cream. I'm like, let's see. Let's go by. We'll we go buy that. two hot and ready pizzas. I didn't know how much they weigh. I think they get, were like two pounds each. And I said, just see if you can even eat it. Mm. I don't even know if I can eat a whole. As a kid, it was like my goal when I was younger, probably younger than you, to see if, you know, my when I first bought my first pizza, I was like, all right, I want to get a small pizza, and I want to try to eat it, which was easy. Then it was like, okay, I want to try to eat my first large pizza, and I don't think I ever did. I don't, I don't, I don't know if I ever went that route, but I was. Mm -hmm. It was one of them things I wanted to see if I could do. But he seems to think he could. I'm like, you think you can eat a whole large pizza? That's a lot of pizza. That's a lot of pizza. Mm -hmm. I love this pepperoni. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it's it's the best pepperoni, even if it's the worst. No, we were talking about it on the way home. It smelled really good. The the but the fact that it gets that little crispy edges, yeah. and again, when you saute pepperoni, it just brings the flavor out, puts a little crunch to it. Tastes so much better. When I think of this pepperoni, I'm thinking of like arcade type of like pizza or like fast, not fast food pizza, but like. You know, like a Chuck E. Cheese type pizza, because they use this pepperoni. You know? Like, like a... I think you've had Chuck E. Cheese once in your life. I've man. never eaten their pizza, I don't think. That's what I'm saying. Like, I don't but even know. I don't think... I think we've only I, gone I, I think once. of a local, like, uh, birthday party, like, bowling alley type pizza. That's what comes to mind. Like, birthday party pizza. Um, I think this is so better, good. pepperoni. It really does. I like that it crisps up. I like that it cups up like that. Mm -hmm. I like the crunchiness. So and you get two pepperonis per bite. I don't think That's I don't ridiculous. think I, I can say enough about it. Look, without just keep repeating myself. My this, favorite this thing is, really is that they cut the pepperonis because they overhang the slices. Well, I couldn't go in between them. Yeah, I know. 
10 out of 10. 11 out of 10. Honestly, if you like a pepperoni pizza, I I'll be I'll be shocked if this isn't your, your best pepperoni pizza. Like, you can't avoid pepperoni. This is one of the ones when, you know, you got one of them kids that's, oh, I don't want the pepperoni. And you're like, take the pepperoni off. It'll be different mm. days trying to pull the pepperoni off. That'll be there. actual years. <laughs> um, so only get this if you like pizza with pepperoni on it. Because um, this has a lot of pepperoni on it. It's good. It's really good. Mm. You, 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 you fry it up just that little bit and it actually brings the heat out into the pepperoni. <laughs> This is this is this is really good. He loves the pizza. Uh, the neighbor just banged outside. So, all right. Well, we can leave it at that, I guess. Right? This is uh, what was the name of this guy? The best pizza we've ever had. I mean, definitely, uh, definitely a must get. I don't. Like it is. It is. Old, I, new I, old world fancy full or something. I will say, out of uh, all the pepperoni pizzas, this is the, the most flavorful pepperoni pizza. And I will reiterate what Ryan said. Mm -hmm. Little Caesar does always put a nice amount of sauce with a nice amount of cheese. Perfect. The perfect amount of pepperoni in it's my It's a book. saucy, cheesy, pep well, way more than what I expected. Mm -hmm. um, we don't, I don't even have to count to say it's over 100. Oh. It's definitely like 150. I'm smiling, giggling, because I kind of secretly hope whoever sends the report of the week one when he does report it. Because he, remember when he took his tie off and threw it down because he was so mad about the thing? They made he, sure. And he was done with little ceases. That it was going to be at least what they said. We're yeah. big fans of report of the week. No, yeah, Ryan, Ryan's, Ryan's a huge fan of report of the week. Mm. So uh, it'll just be funny if he gets like 13 because he counted his remember on the last one they said at least something it wasn't even it was close new extra month's business when they lowered the price or when they raised the price yeah and they said they was gonna they raised the price and they said it was gonna more be 32 percent more pepperoni and it didn't and it wasn't happen well. and he took his tie off and threw it down and it was, it was pretty funny and it was the little caesar's tie they, no they sent him the tie yeah, yeah, yeah. He, yeah, yeah. they sent him the tie they did make up for it though they sent him something else and yeah that it would, would be better but 10 out of 10 on Overall, this way more. Like, I'd give it a 20 out of 10. It, it is actually really possible. good. So leave a comment down below if you have not tried this. I bet the box tastes good. If you have not tried this, I highly recommend going out and get it. If you are a pepperoni fan, mm. this is the best pepperoni pizza I think I've had in a long time. So. <laughs> I'm not sure what that was, but. we The crust? Yep. What I, I'm a big fan. Pizza people, I don't know if that's a common thing, but the crust always rises. Mm -hmm. But they make the crust like a like a handful, like a massive crust. So it kind of takes away the whole like pizza size. I've always said that. Like Ooh. I like thin crust because it goes to the edge normally. Oh, you mean the ones with the big poofy the crust? The big poofy crust uh -huh. because now you have less pizza. Right. I mean this crust. I like their crust first of all. It's like a. I think that's because they put your crust rises more when there's nothing right. on it. So they always put their stuff Straight all the way to the edge. You know what I mean? They have the sauce to the I edge. Mean, their they crust have is only like it's not always, even double what the and base it stays is. super soft too. It's not it's not one of them dry crusts. And they do butter. Right and they butter the bottom because usually yeah. See, yeah. you can see where they they put a little bit. You know, I don't know. I I I. I Ten bucks. I defy I anyone. Leave a comment down below if you get this and you're like, this is terrible. It's the worst pizza ever. I, I, I don't know anyone who likes pepperoni pizza. Unless you don't want this much pepperoni and you only want every other five bites. Yeah. Like, go get Pizza yeah. Hut. Go Unless get... you're a vegetarian, this ain't for you. But right. other than that, honestly, it, it's just a good, especially when you factor in price. I mean, for $9.99... You can't beat this with a stick. You can't. This, this is like this a is $20 a, pizza at like any other place. 18 nah, bucks. that high, bucks. but it's definitely... Go check the prices. It's definitely... Uh, it's, it's I, I, again, we don't... I, I can't remember the last time. We were just talking about that. We, we, we He's been walking me around town lately. and We walked by three pizza parlors. I can't remember yep. the last time we went to a local pizza parlor near us and actually got something just right. because we don't review them. Yeah, and I, I think I like them better. Those Honestly, CDs. and that's that's a compliment. It, it so. just, it, it's it's not, you know, it's hard to compete with the prices. What did we just what did we just have? Oh, 
I mean, when you compare this to like the the quality of the pizza that we just got at the Cumberland Farms, that was like that's what I expected this to taste like. The, yeah, like, like the, school lunch. the school lunch pizza. Yeah, because you get it for half price. So when we just more had, than half in some cases. Well, but but that's what like in my head why I never used to go to Little Caesars was I expected. What am I going to get? School food. You right. know what and I mean? It's hard to convince people. And don't get me wrong, like Little Caesars. Even at the Cumberland Farms, we paid a dollar thirty for a slice. So it was a dollar twenty. Right. I want to eat the rest so, of the pizza. Go ahead. So it was worth it. It really was. You know what I mean? It didn't matter. But that's why we never really went to Little Caesars because I just assumed it wasn't going to be that good. But honestly, buying the pepperoni alone would be like more than ten bucks in my in my mind. Oh, it's right up there because when I buy the like, stick of pepperoni, it, it it's like I, almost eight bucks. How is this it, anywhere? Uh, it's right around. I don't seven, know how this is possible. Bucks. I'm just gonna take this one. Oh, by the road. that's the one I was looking for. So, yeah, all right, well, too. there you go. Leave a comment down below. You just gotta eat Definitely, the pepperoni the, on its own. Honestly, I, I love the cup pepperoni like that. I, I just think it tastes so much better. So, please don't eat all the pepperoni. You're defeating the purpose of everyone gets the two bites and the slice. You right. got like five on this one. We're gonna eat it anyway. So, that being said, if you're still here and you're not subscribed, please subscribe. We're trying to get Ryan to 500. Yep. And, uh, Leave a comment down below what you'd like to see him eat when he hits 500. Because yeah. Because we're creeping up on that. And we are looking for suggestions. Otherwise, we're going to have to come up with something ourselves. And Check out Let's Catch More Mash. Link in the description. Uh, they have fun over there. And, and they do whiskey reviews. If, if you are over there, click the subscribe button over there. And I would be greatly appreciated yep. also. So uh, that being said, hope you enjoyed the video.